back with another video if you are new to my channel go ahead and go ahead that subscribe button down below and if you are returning hello guys what's up mm. so today's video is going to be a freshman's advice video um i have finished my freshman year of high school yay sophomore teens i am going to be a sophomore i am on my summer break and i have been on summer break for a while i just haven't been posting any videos just because i've just been uninspired as i said in the video prior to this one that i'm probably going to i don't know which one's going to come first either this one or the get ready with me but i did do a get ready a get ready with me of this look so if you guys want to know how i on um, with the video for my freshman year when i was first starting high school i did all i did was watch these kind of videos just because i was kind of curious on what to expect for high school and really things that what to expect basically so yeah this is going to be the realest thing you're gonna get yeah i'm not gonna bs we're not gonna do any of this bs stuff because this is stuff that you for real need to know and obviously yeah focus on your grades and things like that but this is just stuff to help you move forward and to just you know you, you just know okay um I, i'm gonna be looking down a little bit just because i have like some notes right here but the first thing is to stay out of drama. Stay out of drama. Like, there is no need for you to be in drama at all whatsoever. It just makes your life like, ten times harder, to be honest. It makes your high school years so much worse than it is. Um, I haven't been in any drama in a while, and that honestly is a really good thing. Um, because it's just really just not worth it at all whatsoever. You don't get any benefit out of it. You just, it's just, y'all are just being immature, basically, because... There really is just no need for to argue or anything like that. And it doesn't really affect you because, like, once you get out of high school, you're not going to really talk to those people ever again or any of that kind of stuff. The second one, don't focus on being popular. That's not important at all whatsoever. The friends that you have going into high school are most likely probably not going to be your friends leaving high school. You learn who your real friends are when the year is over or through that are going to stick with you you who are going to be your ride or dies that whole entire time so they don't even really worry about being friends with people that aren't gonna that don't benefit you that don't um really encourage you don't really help you to be to do better in life yeah being popular isn't really a good thing either like it doesn't really matter at all whatsoever like you can know a lot of people but most likely when you leave out of high school they're gonna popularity is not a thing at all i'm pretty sure in the real world like nobody really cares i'm pretty sure like nobody really cares at all whatsoever the third thing boys 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 girls or boys a um don't focus on being in a relationship or getting into relationship i mean you do meet your high school some people get married to their high school crush or whoever they really like but and it's not really a main focus when you are a freshman because your most your most important years are your first two years, which are your freshman and sophomore year. Um, but mainly your freshman year that counts the most. And the senior, like, don't mess with any upperclassmen. Like, if a guy tries to talk to you that is an upperclassman, like, most like junior or senior, don't even talk to them at all whatsoever because all they want is just one thing, and that is just to get into your pants. They just want that down there area the downstairs the punani the whatever name you got for it they just want that one thing and once they get that one thing you're so hard and just gonna tell you like all these things just to get into your pants but then once they get it they're gonna just leave you up and out like that so it doesn't really matter at all whatsoever so just don't even worry about it if you do want to date just don't <laughs> play it easy just don't um because it really doesn't really matter. You just have your friends or whatever. You can do whatever you want. Stuff like that. Another thing. Parties. We all know that we're going down in the parties. Anyways. I mean, I go to parties. But just be responsible. And just know that what you do can determine how life is going to go. Um, if you do really care about what people think. Honestly, I really just don't think you should care. Um, do you? Just don't even ruin your overall goal once you get out of high school there are going to be a lot of temptations just don't fall into them please just stay steer clear of that and just know what is going to be good for you and just know what's not going to be good for you and same thing goes for things same thing goes for people as well another one 
the fifth thing or the I don't know what number we're on but make relationships with your teachers I've met I've all my teachers I have I still talk to them to this day and things like that it's good to make relationships with your teachers so if you need to put them on like a job application or something like that or you missed the test and you need to remake up your test or you need to you've got a bad grade it it's just good to make relationships with your teachers because in the long run they are going to be there to help you and if you mess up or something or you just need their help with anything they're probably going to most likely be there for you next one is don't fight like there's no need to fight at all whatsoever honestly fighting is super unnecessary it doesn't resolve any issues at all whatsoever it cause more harm than good um you'll probably mess up your money maker or whatever you may think you're big and bad because you really you just not Julie, you're not gonna get any benefit out of it make everything worse to be honest you're probably still gonna have the same beef that y'all had when y'all was fighting so be the mature person and just walk away or if not just deal with your deal with it um in a mature way and that is not fighting so another thing is don't be loud don't be the people that when you walk into the cafeteria, people are like, ew, like, it is no need for you to be loud. I'm pretty sure you, when you're in a group or when you're at lunch or whatever, whatever, you guys are literally in a circle or table or in a group or something. There's no need for you to be screaming, hooting and hollering when you're walking down the hallways, when you're in the hallways, when you're sitting down at the table, when you're doing all this other stuff, because that's just so unnecessary, you're honestly just being loud and drawing attention to yourself for no reason. People are not thinking like, oh my god, they're cute, they're this, they're that. No, we're saying you're annoying. You need to shut up, be quiet, stop talking, like point blank, period! Anyways. <laughs> Don't, like, there's no need for you to be so loud in the morning. Like, I walk into school in the morning and people are, so, like, screaming their lungs out for no reason it is the morning people are just woke up people just put their boogers out of their eyeballs people how many people don't even want to be there at school um so there's no need at all whatsoever it's just super annoying another thing do not walk slow in the hallways do not people have places to be people need to go places people are trying to get to class don't be standing in the hallways talking to your girlfriend being like oh my god girl this is what happened blah, blah blah no unnecessary walk your butt to class that's what you need to be doing walk your butt to class you need to go to class there's only for you to be standing around in the hallways causing drama being messy none of that stuff because that's not cute at all whatsoever you're just in people's way don't be going in with big old groups don't even be walking with big old groups in the hallways because us shorties we trying to get places okay our legs don't even walk like y'all long people do no okay just don't walk on a good pace of not speed walk your butt to class okay and get that education so basically that's it just just don't really worry about I mean you are gonna make friends naturally and that is something that probably um is gonna happen you are gonna meet so many people you are in a place with so many more people in one school so do yeah just don't walk slow in the hallways and stuff like that friends are gonna come naturally over the years or or as time as a year goes by I'm worried about that either yeah that's basically the end of this video i hope you guys really enjoyed this video i hope this is really helpful to you guys i do have more videos coming out so just be on the lookout for that. Don't forget to comment down below what other videos you guys would like to see me make in the future. Make sure to go hit that like button and like it up, like it up, like it up. So I know that you like this video. And also subscribe, subscribe, subscribe if you are new. And make sure you have that notification bell turned on so you get notified every single time I upload a new video. Remember, if anybody hasn't told you they loved you, remember I do. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Mwah!